Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set says that there are four married couples. Uh, Hitesh, Omu, Manas and Edwin are the male members and Sanya, Tanvi, Ambika and Yashi are the female members. Each couple celebrates their marriage anniversary on a different date. These are the four dates and in different months. So we are given the names of months as well. Now some piece of information is given to us that Hitesh and Sanya are married to each other. Only for this couple, the sum of the numerical values of date and month number of their marriage anniversary is a prime number. So you should know that March is the third month, May is the fifth one, October is the tenth one and December is the twelfth month. Okay. So basically what we can figure out is it has to be even plus odd. So if the date is odd, uh, in that case, the month would be even and vice versa because two is the only even prime number. Okay. So we'll come to it later. Sanya celebrates her marriage anniversary on a date, the numerical value of which is twice the numerical value of the date on which Yashi celebrates her marriage anniversary. So now if you look at the values 7 and 14, 12 and 24. So we can have two possible values, whether it is 24, 12 or 14, 7. Can't figure out. Let's read next. Hitesh and Edwin celebrate their marriage anniversaries in different months starting with the same letter. So that gives us, they celebrate in March and May. Okay. The sum of the numerical values of the date and the month of the marriage anniversary of Edwin is equal to the numerical values of the date of marriage anniversary of Manas. So for Edwin, date plus month okay, is equal to the date of Manas. So uh, Edwin we know ki is in March or May. So if we see March, March if we add three, 7 plus 3, 10, we do not get 10. 15 we do not get, 17, 27, not possible. Okay. So Edwin must be in May. And if we see May, if we see 7 plus 5, 12, that fits. So this is Edwin was married on 7 May. Okay. That is marriage anniversary of Manas is 12. All right, so let us make a table like this date wise. Let us put the date first 7, 14, 7, 12, 14, and 24. So these are the four values. And then we will put uh, this is the date, this is the month, and then we will put uh, the husband and the wife. So we know that Edwin is 7 May. Okay, and this is Edwin and Manas is on 12th. Now we are given that uh, these two people, Hitesh is in March. Okay, because Edwin is in May, so Hitesh is going to be in March. And he, for Hitesh, the, uh, the sum of date and month is a prime number. Okay, that is the only couple that has this. So if we say March, that is 3. So 3 added to which number is a prime number? 7 plus 3 is 10. This is 15, 17 and 27. So that means 14 March. 14 March because 14 plus 3 is 17, which is a prime number. 24 plus 3 is 27, which is not prime. Okay. And Hitesh is married to Sanya. Okay. And then we have one person remaining so that we can figure out Hitesh Omu. So that must be. Omo. Right. So this is also used. Sanya celebrates her marriage anniversary double of uh, Yashi. Right. So we know that Sanya celebrates on 14th. So Yashi celebrates on 7th. So we can fill Yashi here. Now no more statements are given to us. So we can fill only these four pieces of these pieces of information. So the first question is for how many of the eight individuals can we correctly determine the numerical value of their marriage date. So we can determine for six of these eight people. If the numeric sum of date and month number of exactly one couple is a perfect square, who is Maras, Manas married to? Okay. All right. So for one couple, the date and this thing is a perfect square. So 10 and 12 are the dates remaining. So if you put 12 plus 12 or 12 plus 10, we do not get a perfect square. But if you put 24 and 12, we get a perfect square. But the question asks, who is Manas married to, right? So we might get the dates, but we will not get who is the lady he is married to. We will get the dates that Manas is married in 
December, uh, October because this is 12 will come here, 10 will come here. But we cannot tell who is he married to. That is what it is asked in the question. So the answer cannot be determined. Okay. All right. So let's look at the next couple of questions. Which one of the following statements is definitely false? Okay. So we knew that 7, 12, uh, 14, 24 and this was uh, 7 May and 14 March. This was Hitesh and Sanya and this was Edwin and Yashi and uh, these two were these were the dates all right so let us answer the questions based on it which of the following statements is definitely false for no couple the numeric sum of date plus month is a square number so we saw that two months that are remaining are 10 and 12 and two ladies are remaining are Ambika and Tanvi okay so if you put 12 here then we can get 36 so it is not definitely false right? it is possibility Omu is married to Tanvi. Again, we do not know who are they married to, right? So this is also a possibility. We cannot say that this is definitely false. Omu's marriage anniversary is on the 12th of October. Now, Omu is married on 24th. So he cannot be married on 12th of October. So that is the incorrect one, okay? Which of the following information would help us identify all the married couples and their marriage anniversaries? So these four pieces are missing they will be among this so first is omu is married to ambika omu married to ambika will give their uh, the couples but will not give the dates so we'll have to look for a statement that gives us date as well as the couple name okay the date and month number of tanvi's marriage anniversary is the same okay now if we see the date and month is same that is applicable only here so this gives us a date as well as the couple name okay so this gives us the complete information Okay, so we need to see we we are missing on two dates and we are missing on two couples. So this is giving us the date also and the couple as well. Uh, if you look at others, Omu's marriage, uh, this will give us the date, but it will not give us the couple. Okay, similarly, Yashi was married on seventh day of the month. That is already given to us. So this is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.